I just woke up. I want to film a get ready with me. And also, I just want to film about this day. Let's get started. And every morning I try to do some special back exercises to keep my back straight and healthy. Let me show you what I do right after I get out of the shower. You know guys, after the shower I don't remove the excess water. Instead, I use this Dewy Glow Serum Mist from this 107 brand. I love this brand so much. This is my favorite mist ever. And it's perfect to do it the way I do. So while my face is still wet, I apply this mist. <gasps> oh my god! No! Nothing left! I wait for it to be absorbed into my skin. After that, I'm using the cream. I'm using this one. It's Velvet Leaf Cream Essence from this 107 brand. I love to use it in the morning. This is the way I apply it on my skin. Also, don't forget about your chest and don't forget about your neck. It is very important to apply it here. Okay, guys, first I blow dry my hair with cold air. And after that, you'll see what I do. Now it's like medium dry and I'm gonna use Dyson to make my hair smooth. To make it look clean and smooth, I'm using this one. It's like a brush. That's it! You know guys, back to my hometown, I never blow dried my hair and I always dry them naturally. So I had this natural waves and my hair looked so so beautiful like so beautiful maybe i'll show you the picture here but here like in korea i think because of the air water and stuff like that i cannot make my hair as beautiful as it was when i don't blow dry them and i just let them dry naturally my hair looks so fluffy after my hair is dry i use hair oil i had hair loss for three months I think I lost half of my hair. I even started receiving comments like, Girl, your hair is thin. Can I change my genetics right now? I mean, okay. When people leave such comments, what they expect you to react to their message? Like, my hair is thin, oh my god. How can I break my genetic line? Should I transplant a new hair or, um... I mean, you know what I'm saying, guys? I'm trying. I'm trying my best. And I also add kimchi. It's time for me to leave. I have meeting today and I finished my Korean homework. I forgot to film that, actually. <laughs> so, let's go with me. Look at my lips before, okay? And right now, this lip gloss is gonna improve the blood circulation, like, in my lips. So, they are gonna look juicier. It's gonna give your lips this natural pink color. I cannot wait to launch it and I really want you guys to try it. Look at the color. This is the first color. This is the second color. And I already put the third lipstick in my bag. But, I mean, look at this. And they all have different effect on your lips. I'm ready to go. Let's go. I'm gonna take this bag. I love this bag so much. I mean, look at the color. I'm gonna use this perfume. Look at this. This are the parcels from my followers. <gasps> Look how amazing it is. From India. <gasps> Whoa. I'm gonna read it alone. Okay, because I think when you're sending me letters, it's such a like, you know, private thing. I want to keep it. I want to read it before bed. The second letter, this person sent it from Korea, which is amazing. I'm so happy. The person put this chocolate inside. And a letter. Oh my God. 
Thank you. The next parcel I know from where it is. This parcel is from Japan. This is actually from my friend. This is Bear Brick. This is a limited edition, by the way, Bear Brick. See this bear brick for my interior. I love such unique things and also this uh, small version. This parcel is from Vladivostok. I forget Vladivostok and me отправили посылку. Блин, спасибо тебе большое. Oh my god! Here's my name. Yes. Oh my god, it's a tumbler. Hold on. Tomorrow is February 14th, it's a Valentine Day, right? I'm thinking where should I take myself on a date? And what should I do? Because I can also film a vlog. I bought this thing, it's like a planner. The first thing that I'm gonna do, work out, film a get ready with me for my TikTok. After that, what are we gonna do after that? I'm gonna take myself on a day and I, what am I gonna do, bro? Call me a work. Okay, I think I'm... That's enough, right? What people usually do on Valentine's Day, I... I have no idea. I woke up at 1.30. Let's work out. Finished. My makeup is done. Let me finish my TikTok. I'm feeling some TikToks right now and actually it's 427. Oh my god, what did I do all this time? I want to walk in the park and I want to eat something because I'm so hungry. I haven't eaten anything yet. This is so beautiful. I suddenly met my friend because I thought that I'm gonna spend time alone with myself as we planned with you guys but that was even better you know I got a parcel I couldn't find this kettle here this is my favorite kettle because you guys know that I love drinking hot water in the morning this kettle can maintain uh, water temperature for like very long time good morning I already finished my back workout I do some special back workout I'm trying to do it every day so I can keep my back healthy when you're getting older I'm watching some YouTube video <laughs> And when you're getting older, it's very important and your face will be prettier because it's all about your posture. I need to go to some coffee shop because my friend sent me some coupon yesterday and she sent me a cake for Valentine's Day. And after I come back from coffee shop, I gotta finish my Korean homework. 
because I have a class today and I also have a therapy session today. Guys, I'm doing little grocery shopping right now. I'm trying to find yogurt. Yogurt. But why is it so big? <laughs> I don't need such a big yogurt. I'm gonna try this one. This is my first time in such a big market, you guys. That's crazy. Why is it so big? I'm gonna take this t-shirt. Wow. Oh my god. Endless market. Back rooms. <laughs> Am I in the back rooms? The only thing that I wish they had more is bread. Like yeast free, sugar free bread. Okay, let's go. I'm going into eat sushi right now. Because why not? But it's not like sushi, it's like rolls. Mm, I actually was quite lazy to cook lunch, so I decided to buy this roll. Matcha latte. I made this matcha latte right now. Mm. I think I studied for three hours today. And I also studied a little bit in the morning, so just practicing every day like daily Korean. I think my problem is that most of the time I'm really shy to talk to people because I'm really shy to show them that I make mistakes which is really stupid because when you're learning new language you should talk, you should make mistakes because you're learning from it, you're learning from your mistakes. So I'm trying to overcome this thing, I'm trying to talk more. Sometimes when someone is asking me something I know how to answer in Korean, in my brain, you know, but because I'm shy, I give them an answer in English. Just why? I think I started learning Korean last year, but actually, you guys, for me, the end of 2021 and the beginning of 2022, I was so depressed. I was overeating, overthinking. By the time when I started learning Korean, I didn't have friends, I didn't even go out, so I was staying home, but then I started working on myself harder and I realized that I love Korean language and I would really like to talk in Korean. I think that is what we're supposed to do. Just live our best life, learn something new, meet new people, do what you, makes you feel happy, you know. to Pantan again, finally. We cannot find anything to eat. <laughs> Why is it so hard? Why is it so hard to find something to eat? Yes. Snow! <laughs> Whoa. The clothes that they got from the the rent store. I don't know what is it called, but unfortunately I couldn't buy my own because I didn't have time for that. It was like suddenly we decided to go. But after this trip, I'm gonna buy my own all these things, you know, all the stuff for surf. Look at that road. Maybe one day I will be able to do that, but I didn't know that it looks that scary. I think this is the fourth time that I'm going up. It's getting better and it's so much fun when you can actually do this. Break time.
came to the hotel room oh my god my whole body is in pain and i think i have some problem with my knee because it's super red and swollen ah can you see can you see how swollen it is and this part is red the first day was amazing but i can ride it like you know few few from one place to the other place i can go straight but I, i'm too afraid to just go straight and it's not safe but i felt so bad it was super painful so i tried level one and level two level two was super scary for real i don't know how can i don't know how can people ride this like red roads when it's like just going down like this crazy down road i don't know how can they do that that's so scary people how you do that and on the next day for breakfast i had meal cook at this pretty popular restaurant look at this i mean it's huge and that was delicious I ate at this fish restaurant right now and when I was about to go out um, how can I say teenagers they came up to me and they said oh are you a youtuber I said oh yeah, yeah. and we took a picture together I was so happy I'm still so shy guys if you're watching this video right now thank you for watching my youtube channel every time when I meet my fans I am so 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 happy and shy you know it's my mood booster guys i hope i filmed something from my trip because it was my first time snowboarding and i was really focused on the process i wanted to get better so that's why it was hard to film anything today i'm planning to spend my whole day at home because my body hurts so bad everything hurts so bad especially my legs my butt my hands everything even my neck i just want to have some rest I want to recover fully well you guys i think i will end this vlog today because tomorrow i'm gonna have a live stream with you and i also have some work tomorrow thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video let me know if you want me to film more videos like this and i love you all i will have some good rest and see you soon bye